You might have been driving in the Comox Valley after a fun night out with some friends, coming to a familiar intersection in downtown Courtney. What do you think was there? If you could put yourself back to September of 1946, at the corner of England and Sixth, imagine finding a church right in the middle of the intersection. That was an exciting time uh, for us because, wow, how are they going to move that? You know, it might fall apart. It's been built for a good number of years, which turned out to be 1913. I didn't know that at the time, particularly. What was a church doing in the middle of the road? At that time, St. George's United Church was growing and needed a larger location, so they chose to move the building physically from what is now Fifth Street, where Hot Chocolates is located, to its current location at Sixth and Fitzgerald. Lawrence Burns has some fond memories when he was 17 of that particular day. Now, after the first day, they stopped uh, just about the Legion, and then the next day, they, they moved out into the intersection of what's now Sixth and England, and it was um, um, stalled there overnight. They had to put some uh, warnings up, I guess, look out. You know, imagine a guy coming home late at night and all of a sudden he sees the church in front of him. <laughs> Wonder what uh, he was looking at. Ellen Wise grew up in the Comox Valley and is a member of the church. And I guess the huge thing was that once they settled it on the foundation, there was not one crack and the bell did not ring once. It was done so smoothly. So that's how it got here. And that was uh, <clears throat> in September. The history of the St. George's Church, originally a Presbyterian church, goes back to 1913. So in 1913, Joseph McPhee, who was called the father of Courtney, donated three lots on Fifth Street, which was then called Union Street, and they started the procedures for building this church. This part of the church, without a few additions, etc., was the original part of the church. This is the sanctuary that was built in 1913. 2013 is the centennial celebration of the original St. George's Church, and on September 21st, there will be a gala celebration. For more information, go to stgeorgesunited.com. From the Comox Valley, this is Judy Miracano.